Hey guys, Claire Pears here. Today, I'll be doing an oil change and servicing this Aaron's lawnmower with the Kawasaki FJ180V engine. We'll also be replacing the oil filter, and I've got this Wix XP 5139-4XP, which should fit this oil filter location right here, but we'll see about that. The oil drain bolt is located right up here, which is why I have it up on these uh, jack stands and a jack. That way I'm able to drain the oil straight down into here. The next thing we're going to do is take the oil filter off. I got this little uh, milk jug catch can underneath it in case we get any drips off of it. And then we'll test fit our uh, new Wix filter we got. Before you put on the new one, I went ahead and cleaned off the uh, little seat here where the gasket sits on. It was kind of dirty, and just in case this filter is a little bit bigger, we don't want it resting on top of the dirt. Now for the moment of truth. Does this new filter fit on here? Let's see. And there we go. It looks like it fits on there. Let's snug it on up now. Now we'll go ahead and reinstall the drain bolt. Okay, now I'll take it off the blocks and refill it with oil. Next thing to do is uh, fill up the oil. We'll be using some 10W30 for this one. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see that right now, but that's right up to there, which is about three quarters of the way up, and I'm gonna call that good. The next thing to do is take this outside and run it for a minute to get the oil circulating through the oil filter, which is dry at the moment. Okay guys, the oil is pretty much all the way up to the top there, so I think I'm going to leave it like it is and call it good. I'm starting to notice this thing's looking pretty dirty, so I think before I bring it back to the customer, I'll go ahead and clean it up a little bit. Okay, there we go. Nice and clean. Ready to bring back to the customer. If you found this video helpful, remember to give it a like and subscribe so you don't miss another video like it. Mm -hmm. 